Hey everybody, welcome back to another limited edition games unboxing and let's play where I like to open up some of the small run limited edition games, usually collector's editions, usually for the Nintendo Switch, and give a kind of reactionary review, first attempt of playing a game and see what we think. And today we're back with another game from one of my all time, if not, they are my favorite company, who am I kidding? Limited run games. Now as you can tell, this is not a collector's edition. Not every release they put out is a collector's edition. Um, outside of a, for a few of the earlier games I'm, where I missed a couple of collector's editions, I've been having really good luck getting all the collector's editions this time. So this is pretty much guaranteed to just be one they didn't have a collector's edition for. But we're gonna check this out. I'm sure there's a card. Will we get gold foil? We'll find out. I'm sure there's an instruction booklet. And of course in the middle, we'll do a nice little let's play and see what we think of the game. Now I have no idea which game this is. You probably already know because of the title, but we're just gonna go in easy here. And uh, I do like their bubble mailers. They work pretty well. And the game is, ah, Miss Splosion Man. And we did just get a silver foil card. That's all right. Limited run. Excellent. So there is the logo as usual. And there is the card, number 546. Trippy art. I actually quite like that. Very nice. Here, of course, is the game with the plastic on. We will, of course, take that plastic off and give you a better look at it when it's a little bit less reflective. And it is limited run games number 47. 47? I know that's not the joke, but I wanted to make it anyways. All right, let's get rid of that little plastic shred that I just pulled. Take the cellophane off. Put it in the magical cellophane bag behind me and give you a slightly better look at this. Yeah, I'm getting a DD from Dexter's Lab vibe there and I'm loving it. And uh, this looks like a very interesting game. Is it platforming? Is it, I think it's platforming. Oh, and you can play up to four player action. Okay, that's pretty cool. Cartoon violence, drug references, mild lyrics? Mild suggestive themes. Huh. All right, well, what do I got on the inside? Ooh, I really like this reversible cover. I really like that reversible cover. I wish it had the title down the spine, but other than that, that's really beautiful. And there is the cartridge. All right, well, I guess that didn't take long. Now let's play. <laughs> Okay, so this is actually my fifth game in a row tonight. It's 2.40 a.m., still drinking vodka, still waiting on The Mandalorian, and I wasn't necessarily going to do this one, but if I do this one, it clears all the unboxings I've done. So let's do it. Let's check out Miss Splosion Man. Limited run, right, I believe? I did so many in a row. Yeah, okay, cool. And you know what? Five for five. No updates. And I don't know why in the unboxing I didn't pick up on the idea that it's Miss Splosion Man, but I dig the hell out of that. I'm already intrigued. Oh my god. What the hell? It looks like a Mi 6 on, on freaking crack, dude. Holy crap. I know I can skip, but I don't feel like I should. I feel like this is part of what we're here for. Why am I being triggered with food fight flashbacks? Except it's not food. And it's more acceptable in the animation because this is a game, but what? You gotta see the creation of Miss Explosion, man. Ah, Mrs. Look at me! Okay, on a very... <laughs> on a very awkward episode of Weird Science. <laughs> All right. All right, at least aesthetically and everything, I'm already loving the hell out of it. <laughs> it's just the tone, the style, the graphics. Pretty cool. Single player, multiplayer, leaderboards. I'm by myself tonight, so let's do some single player. New game. Music sounds pretty dope. Did I get a soundtrack for this one? I can't remember. Was this a collector's edition one? I can't remember. And it was like two days ago. Oh. Oh, wow. Just checking out my buttons. Oh, do I explode things that are in my way? Is that what the deal is? <laughs> Sorry, the little twinkle toes bit got me. Big Science Labs Incorporated presents. That looks like my PlayStation background. Splodin' and you. Plus in one, base explode. 
Loading with care is the key to a healthy lifestyle. Okay. Meet Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Sarah brushes oh, her hi, teeth Sarah. and does her homework on time. Ooh. She's a good explosion woman. Okay. That's Debbie. She's Ugh. a stupid. <laughs> When Sarah explodes a barrel, oh, wow. she holds the control stick the entire time. But let's watch Debbie. She lets go of the stick when she hits the barrel. Wrong move. Oh. Okay. Observe this gap. Sarah is frugal with her explodes, saving each until she absolutely needs it. Okay. Debbie twitches on her explode button like a heroin junkie. <laughs> she should have spaced out her explodes. Now she's used them all up and is nothing but char. This is one of my Nobody favorite tutorials Debbie. I've ever seen. <laughs> Sarah explodes off walls to quickly get where she's going. Okay, so you can kind of wall jump right on. Debbie, come on out, Debbie. Don't be scared. <laughs> Give it a try. Oh, you're gonna smash me again, aren't you? No, Debbie, we're not gonna smash you again. Lies! <laughs> Alright, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Sarah knows that she can explode three oh, times before she needs to recharge. She can recharge by touching the ground, sliding on a wall, or right, by so exploding a barrel. Three. And then it's pretty much just a 2D platformer, Very it looks like. Nice, Sarah. Oh, I'm a single lady. I'm a single lady. <laughs> hold on, Debbie. Why don't you oh, demonstrate boy. how you oh, can hold the right trigger to kill yourself Debbie. if you ever get stuck? <laughs> That's a good girl. They are me six, sort of, aren't they? Here we have a couple of zip lines. The straight ones you need to explode off of. While the hook-ended ones will throw you all by themselves. Okay. A lot of information at once, though. Whoopsie daisy. You forgot to explode. I didn't do it. I'm not it doing this, try, by the way. Sarah. It's just... Everyone makes mistakes. Awesome. Perfect. Yeah. Oh God, Debbie, don't screw this up, Debbie. You can. Hey. You did it. Yeah, good job, Debbie. But you know, Debbie, you should have kept your hands off my man. <laughs> okay. I like exploding the people. Oh, I wanted to explode that guy. I did a thing. I guess I was supposed to do that. Oh, wait, no, I screwed up. Hold on, what does that do? Nothing? All right. Nice. Oh, I'm sorry. I left you alive and I didn't mean to. <laughs> Alrighty. One, two, three. Where are you going? Just want to explode you. That's what you made me to do. <laughs> Alright, she sticks to the walls a little too. That's kind of neat. I'm not killing everybody. Because I'm not a bitch. No. <laughs> not like Debbie. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but I love it. Yeah, this is like super simple joystick and one button gameplay. But my god, it's fun. It's kind of got that Mario fun in terms of, like, the play mechanics of it. Woo! Damn, Splosion Girl. I'm sorry, Splosion Man. Splosion Man. Hi. Is it me or is she actually kind of cute? <laughs> Whoa. This looks like it would be fun as a VR game. Like one of those VR platforms. What?
Don't, don't, don't worry, Sarah. You can do this. I didn't even do it. Am I doing anything? Oh. Oh, am I supposed to be running from him? Oh, I, I thought I was, uh, okay. Sorry. I thought I was, I'm just, all the games I played tonight, I thought I was supposed to be fighting a boss. Did I miss it? Okay. Oh, I totally missed that one. Okay, shit. All right. La, 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 la. Now that we have an idea of what we're doing. Wait, what? 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 Hold on. I, I must be not timing it right. This just got a whole lot more complicated. But probably in a good way. Aha! Okay, I see. It gives me enough of a boost to... All right, I just the 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 two and a half D angle is screwing me up. Whee! Oh, nice. Oh, not so nice. Mm, pay attention to the game. Whew. Oh, Mario's oh, yeah, playing Shovel Knight. Do I have to? All right, cool. Stupid girl. What are you, garbage? <laughs> That sounds like I still have a boss fight coming. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, I see. Okay, all right, all right. No, this is awesome. Oh, shit. Run, 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 run. Okay, I am legitimately really enjoying this. <laughs> Great job, Limited Run Games. Excellent curation. Curation. Good choice on doing this game. I don't under... Oh, hold up, hold up. Oh, I have to activate it. Oh. Oh, did we get him? Moving on. Okay. Very cool. Checkpoint. Do I need to be going higher or faster? He is tracking my movements a little bit there. Yep. All right, where's the thing? Oh, I just had to jump over, okay. Whee! To jump or not to jump? To explode or not to explode? That is the question. A question which is about to be answered. Look at me and my timing. Whoa! Oh, good. It checkpointed for me. This. Okay, this is super freaking fun. Mighty, eternal, weak spot is his eye. I don't know how I'm supposed to target a thing. Um, what am I doing? Oh! Ah! I need the thing. Where's the thing? Oh, did I miss it? Shit. Oh, fuck. Where am I? Here I am. Oh! Again, I don't know how I'm supposed to target his eye. I'm just gonna stand here until the thing shows up. Did that not... Mm. Okay. I hope this is one of those things where, like, I love it, and then, like, I get to this thing, and I get stuck, and I hate it. That's different. Oh, I think I need to, okay. Oh, I didn't make it, shit. I got it. Two, oh fuck, nope, I don't got it. Just just hang there a minute, boss guy. 
Oh, why can't I get that last hike? Do I need to go off the wall? Oh. Uh, it looks like maybe that's what I'm trying to do. Hold on. I'm glad he's just waiting there for me. I appreciate it. There we go. Explode it. Nice. Probably have to do that a couple more times or something like it. What now? What puzzle do I need to solve now? Oh, shit. Did I not? Fuck. Sorry, when the camera gets that far out, at the distance I am from my TV with some stuff in the way, it becomes a little bit problematic. So I guess that's really just an opportunity to dodge. Yep. Oh, I got a little spark in his face there. Adorable ball. Oh, shit. Went a little too soon on that one. Is the game... Ah, oh, shit. I may have the game a little quiet, by the way. I'm sorry. But in the middle of this, I ain't... Oh, something just changed. What are we doing? Ah. Where did I go? Where did I go? Okay. Jump, 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 jump. Get up there. Nice. Nice. Explode, explode. His eye's open. His eye is open. We're tapping the button. Hump it. Hump it real good. Aww. Oh, nice pose. Oh, shit. I'm just like constantly tapping the button. But I don't think I'm actually doing anything. I think it's all doing it itself. Oh, my God. I guess I'm kind of doing that when the explode thing comes on the screen. So I'm just gonna keep tapping. I wanna be tapping it when it has to happen. Tapping it makes it happen it. Happen it, happen and tapping it. That was totes fun. This is an awesome game and I absolutely love it. Did I miss my option to get up there for the thing? <laughs> Oh, is he Predator exploding? Oh my god, he's Predator exploding. Dude. That is awesome. That is awesome. Oh, wow. Um, sure. I'm sure I didn't rank that well, but... Oh, I got a lot of scientists. I got a lot of gold. Uh, let's see where I am in the leaderboard then. Best score? Is nobody else playing this game anywhere? Uh. Seriously, am I this early to the game and like nobody... Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, my scores... Oh, that's, oh, that's against friends. Wait, I'm doing ZL and ZR. Oh, I don't know why it was... Pfft, okay. Here we go. This is what I was looking for, is how are we... I'm certainly not in the top ten. Level 1-1. One, one. That's all I really played. Oh, that's pretty cool. What if I just hold it down? Oh, I'm not even top 100. Okay, that actually makes sense. <laughs> not that great. Um, oh, crap. I didn't mean to trigger the cutscene. Okay, good. Well, anyways, we're in the hub world. Guys, guys and gals and everybody out there, I love this game. This is great. Y'all, I don't know who picks the games over there. Josh, Doug. I, I, I know, like, Doug, like, posts about getting excited about they finally got a IP, but I don't know who chose this one, but whoever chose them, give, give, this, give them a damn raise. This is awesome. This is, like, up there with like a Thumper or a Thimbleweed Park for me in terms of limited run games releases. 
I just uh, wish this one had a special edition, like a collector's edition. I'm not sure why we didn't get one for this, but that is awesome and I love it. And I'm definitely gonna play more of that, probably on Patreon or something at some point. So let me know, what do you think? Tell me, but we're now, we're gonna get back to this unboxing and we're gonna take a look at the instruction manual, I suppose, so enjoy. Take it away, Eric. All right, well, hopefully that was as fun and insane as the box art has me believing it is. But before we pop out of here, we're gonna take a quick look through this instruction booklet. Or actually, sorry, mini art book. Very cool. So I'll get a sense of this game before I get to play it. And we will try to go on here and pause if you want. Oh, I'm getting a real Dexter's Lab vibe. Is this like Dexter's Lab, the adult years? Because I could totally see that. And now that I say that, I would be totally down for that as an actual cartoon. Holy hell, okay. Oh my God. Okay, oh my, okay, I think I am going to love this. I think this is gonna be batshit and it's gonna be fantastic. <laughs> I am suddenly really, really excited to play this game. The art is fantastic. And if that translates into the game, it's gonna be way too much fun. I'm actually kind of getting Dexter's Lab meets the Venture Brothers even, so even cooler. Nice, this feels like something that probably should have had a, an actual collector's edition with like a plush or something, but that's just my thoughts. But how do you all feel about this? Have you played this game? Did it look like fun? Are you gonna pick it up on the eShop? Did you get the limited run version? Well, let me know, geek out with me in the comments. I'd love to hear what you have to say. Other than that, you can click that thumbs up button, give me that good old thumb of encouragement as I do love to be encouraged. And of course you can check out my Patreon for more video game let's plays, movie reviews, movie commentaries, all kinds of fun stuff. And a lot of it's even free. You can find that by looking up the Eric Butts or using the link in the description below. But now I'm gonna get on out of here so I can go play some more stuff and open up some more things and I'll see you all later.